We've all seen images of how plastic is devastating our oceans and marine life. I'm sure many of you have seen plastic just washed up on the beach. Well, today we're learning about the pollution caused by waste and the impacts of this. Humans have lived in this planet for thousands of years, but in relatively small numbers. In the early 1800s, our population passed the 1 billion mark for the first time. In the last 200 years, it has skyrocketed to over 7 billion people. And the United Nations predicts there will be nearly 10 billion people by 2050. In addition to this huge number of people, our standard of living is definitely increasing. This means that we are using more and more resources and producing more and more waste. And if this waste isn't handled properly, it can cause serious pollution, which is reducing biodiversity by killing animals and plants. There are three types of pollution that you need to know about. The first is land pollution. In the previous video, you saw that landfill sites destroy natural habitats and the household waste can spread toxic chemicals from the waste into the soil. Pesticides and herbicides are one example. They can get into food chains when plants covered in the toxic chemical are eaten. The further up the chain you go, the more toxic chemical accumulates, which can end up poisoning top predators. The second type of pollution is air pollution. When we burn things, the smoke that comes off it contains tiny solid particles that can hang around in our atmosphere. Humans and animals breathe them in, causing damage to the lungs. Acidic gases like sulfur dioxide are also formed when fossil fuels are burned. This then dissolves into rainwater, forming acid rain, which can kill animals and plants in lakes. And thirdly, we've got water pollution. This includes pesticides, herbicides, sewage and fertilizer. All of these can get into our waterways, but the last two contain nitrates. When they're washed into the water, it can cause algae to grow very rapidly, but it will then die. And when this happens, microorganisms break it down, but they use lots of oxygen out of the water to respire. And this low oxygen level means that aquatic organisms like fish die. One tip to remember these three types of pollution is law, land, air, water. And the link is that perhaps we need more laws to protect our environment from this pollution. If we don't, biodiversity will continue to drop and drop. Okay, now it's time for some quick questions. Pause the video, give them a go, and press play to go over the answers. One, give two reasons why more waste is being produced in recent years. There's an increasing human population and an increasing standard of living. Two, how does waste impact biodiversity? There are two parts to your answer. We need to give the mechanism and then the impact on biodiversity. So waste will actually produce more pollution, which will kill animals and plants. That's the mechanism. Reducing biodiversity. That's the impact. And three, name three types of pollution. Just remember the letters law, stand for land, air, and water. And you can write that down just somewhere on the side of your paper for yourself. And four, give one example of air pollution. You could have said smoke or acidic gases, and you could even have named some, for example, sulfur dioxide or nitrogen oxides, etc. All right, how did you do? Next up, we're finding out about peat bog destruction and deforestation. Click here to find out more and please subscribe if you're finding this useful. Thanks and bye!